A bunch of dreamers with a fist up. Trigger happy, aim a high, we never give up. When we fall, it's cause we stood for what we came for. I guess it's time a brother finally took the chains off. Imagine when my bars grow up. I be sunning all the niggas that I saw blow up. Hope they fall like Willie Beeman and they all throw up. Cause I'm sure in 20 seconds they will all know us. Victory, baby, can you see it? Are you with me? They calling me a preacher. I guess that makes you with me. If Denzel comes, then this moment won't be empty. I swear the night's a movie. At the end, I'm gonna miss me. Credits, let them all roll. What an honor. I planted my dream. Every future needs a farmer. Tonight I'm getting lifted with two bitches. No car. I even run sentences, nigga, what a problem And here's the audio believers You know the ones that don't believe us Baby, play it for your X2 And all the kids around my table yelling, F you Good evening ladies and gentlemen and welcome to Extreme Slam Wrestling. I am one of your new commentators, Fane Bell, along with Joe Graham. How are you tonight? Alright, are we ready Joe? I mean this is a packed arena. I know this is one of your first time ever commentating. I'm known as, I was in a lot of other companies so let's get right down to it. Let's get ready. Tony Gibson, the ESW champion, has requested mic time. Let's go straight into it, shall we? I believe I made a promise to S.H.I.E.L.D. that I would decimate him at all or nothing. Not only have I decimated him, but I retained the ESW Championship, whether you like it or not. It happened. At least you know that I don't have to cheat to win or retain it like S.H.I.E.L.D. did once. I will continue dominating anyone that goes for the title because I am a fighting champion. Even Mr. K would have helped, I still would have won because I am too dominant. Ryan Riley didn't come help me at all or nothing, and he will never do that in situations like this. Whoever won this title and wants to live better work their ass off competing against one of half decimator Tony Gibson. What an amazing promo. Now let's talk about the highlights of all of nothing here. Let's look at this. I mean, holy shit. Diving off the ladder onto his opponent, then curb stopping him. Not over yet, but dives off the ladder onto uh, the, his down opponent. Ladies and gentlemen, please welcome Grizz. Fucker. The champ has arrived. Um, yes indeed. Quite an entrance there, Grizzly. Thank you, Weber. Anyways, at All or Nothing, you participated in the four-man turmoil match for the Universal Championship and defeated Jesse Smoke with the bear hug. How does it feel to be the Universal Champion? Let me tell you, Weber. It feels damn good to be the champ. I've been here for a very short period of time, and I already became the champion. Not only did I get the title shot so early in my career, but I became the first person to win the Universal Championship, and that's going to be in the history book. Well, thank you for your time, Grizzly, and uh, good luck on your match tonight. Now let's get ready for the first contest of the night, which is King Grizzly, the Universal Champion here. I mean, look at this. He's coming out with a Kendall stick and alcohol. I, are we are we are we allowed to drink alcohol? I didn't know that. Uh, I'm not quite sure. No, well, like... damn. I mean, like, holy. <laughs> I, I guess he didn't like that alcohol. I'm guessing it was probably um, what's what's that one alcohol? That one that's really bad. Uh. uh... Crap. Yeah. Oh well. Got me. Anyways, anyways, yeah. Let's let's get back into here. I mean, 
Grizzly. What can we not say about him? The king of the jungle. And he is wrestling Acosta? I yeah. believe so. Acosta, that's how you say his name. Sorry, guys, I have a bit of an accent. Hard to say that. Um, I mean, I'm interested to see this. I know, Joe, you're interested to see this. Oh, yeah, this is going to be a hell of a match. Oh, yeah. So, I mean, like, look at this. He is a, he is a charisma man. Like, he loves to be charismatic. You can just tell that. I mean, we might as well call him the charismatic charismatic enigma but that might go into someone else that we can't really name so right. <laughs> you know due to some legal issues yeah now here we are the man known as Acosta I mean I don't really know this man very well in fact I don't know any of these guys very well but I can tell you this right now this match is going to be very interesting. I mean, like, I, I want that shirt, by the way. I just want to say that. I like that shirt. <laughs> very interesting. You know. But anyways, uh, let's go into a little bit of details of ourselves. Uh, I am, uh, as a lot of you guys might know, I am a commentator in another show. Um, you know, you can follow me at bell underscore fame. You know, at bell fame. Um... You know, that's my Twitter. Joe, you don't really remember your Twitter right now, so we'll, we'll talk about that later. Yeah. But, you know, I mean, so I was once a wrestler, and now I'm here being a commentator. Joe, what about you? I was once a wrestler, I kind of retired. Okay. You couldn't get away from the business, could you? Nope. No, nope, but one day. No, nope, God love it. Once you enter the square circle, you're in it for life, essentially. But anyways, nope. let's, let's talk about this match. Look at this. They're taunting at each other. The ref says go. Uh, looks like a little bit of a stare down going on. Look at that circle in the ring and uh oh yeah, definitely a stare down. Oh, power and elbow tie up. Who's gonna win this? Oh, it's a draw. Oh, who's uh, they're going at oh it again? God. Another draw. Okay, wow, these these guys. These oh guys my God, are amazing right oh. now. Oh God, that Short was suplex pin. One. Two! Is it? Oh my god! That was a terrible idea for Acosta to taunt right in front of Grizzly. What did you expect from that? Oh, nice little flip. Oh! oh! I was actually expecting him to turn him around and just pick him up. Yeah, I mean, look at this. Like, Grizzly right now is just. is. Wait, is he hitting him in the groin? Is that a DQ? What is the ref doing here? That was DQ. He hit him in the groin. That should have been a disqualification, but I don't think the ref was really paying attention. Well, and that's his job. Oh, there we go. Acosta <laughs> reversed. I mean, like, so far it's been 90%, uh, well, actually full percent towards Grizzly. I mean, all these power moves. Now Acosta are doing his combo right now. Uh-oh, he got some against the ropes. Uh -huh. What is he going for? Oh, oh Ooh, a nice, nice. backbreaker. That was not, oh, a rope. We're going for the pin. Rope break. Uh oh, throwing him into the corner. What's he going for? Turn Ooh, out. A punch of just a straight punch in the face. Is that illegal? It's illegal for a straight punch in the face. I don't know why. But there you go. Uh oh. Yeah. Grizzly reverses. What's he going for? A nice stare down again. Another power and elbow tie up. What's gonna happen here? Who oh. happens? Take the lead. Grizzly, Grizzly took the lead. Yep, there we go. Uh oh, he just just pushes him to the corner uh nice oh nice. nice spinning clothesline oh man uh oh just throwing him right back in there oh a big boot for good measures here uh oh nice front headlock oh a nice headbutt i'm oh, uh, going for the God. pin already one two oh kick out you got to do a little bit more i think a oh, nice spin kick uh oh going in the ropes what bumped into each other uh, stay down going in the ropes again Bump into each other again. Okay, uh, signaling for the end already. What's gonna? Oh, a nice catching <laughs> face buster. Oh, nice running bulldog. Oh my God. Going for the Will pin. The One, end? two. A nice nope. kick out. Yeah, yeah. I was, I was hoping it wasn't the end. I mean, it couldn't be. I, I know they're just trading blows back and forth at each other. Uh oh, Grizzly reverses. Uh oh. Oh no. Ooh, nice. Oh, he, did he just flick off the camera? Yes, uh -oh. he did. Uh-oh, he's signaling for the end. He wants him up. He wants him up. What is he going for? Uh-oh. Oh, oh is he's going for a nice jump. Oh, nice reverse into a DDT by Acousta. That was amazing. Oh, what, what's Acousta going for? Uh, is he... Cl what, what's going on? Is he clapping for the end? Uh, 
I don't know what's going. Oh, Grizzly leaves you. Escape. Oh, that's uh oh. Wait, what's Grizzly oh, doing my here? God. Oh, punch the face. Uh oh, Grizzly throwing him to the ropes. And that spear out of nowhere. Oh my God, going for the pin. One, two, th oh. oh, two and a half. Oh, man, just there we go. Training blows again. Uh-oh, Kusa getting in the advantage here. What's going to happen? Going on the ropes? An oh, a super kick to the jaw. What's Acousta going for? Oh, he's taunting for him to get up. What's he going for? And a, a spear of his own. Oh, my God. Going for the pit. One, One two, two, three. Oh, oh, Grizzly kicking out. My God, what? Oh, Grizzly's signaling for the end. Kusa said, I'm out. I'm out. Uh-oh, Grizzly's following. Oh. This could be dangerous. Uh-oh. Throwing him to the barricades. It just bounces off. Now they're having another stare down. Oh, trading blows again. I think they're just trying to prove who's more manlier of the each other. You know? Oh, Knights on the barricades again. Oh! Nice running running bulldog. bulldog. Was that on the chair? They broke the chair. Oh, my God. How can a man endure this uh -oh. much punishment? Throws right him here. on the barricade. Ends the count. What's going on? Oh, throwing him back on the barricade. What's going to happen? Wait. Oh, no. Oh, no. And that spear! Oh! Right through the barricade. They broke the barricade. Oh, th this is the opening match. What the Oh, my God. I mean, uh-oh. Is he getting... Is, he's getting a chair? Throwing in the ring... I don't know if this is no DQ match or what. This is, oh my god, he just speared him through the barrel. Clearly so, if the ref's not throwing it out. Two chairs in the ring right now. Uh-oh, what's going to happen out there? Uh, Acousta throws, hits him in the corner. Oh, nice clothesline. Clearly it is DQ because the ref just threw the chair back out. Uh-oh, it's, oh man. Grizzly had enough. He just jumped up. Oh, no. Is he going for a comeback? Double clothesline. Ducks under. What's going on? What's going on? Oh, I'm... Ooh, Ooh. Two at the world. Backbreaker. What's Acousta going for right now? Corner. Uh-oh. Uh-oh. This is one of my famous moves. The super kick. Here we go. Is he going to hit it? Is he going to... And... Oh, no. Oh, Grizzly reverse. God. Oh, he's going into his... Oh, the rock... I'm going at the rock bottom right now. Flicks off the ref. I don't know why. Uh-oh. Signaling boy. for the end. Is this over? Is this over? He's going for a... Uh-oh. He's going for a choke slam. And I... Oh, my Ooh. God. It's over. One, two, three. It's over. It's... That was a hellacious match, in my opinion. You know... I have to agree with you. Of course... Grizzly won. He is the Universal Champion. Of course, we knew if Acousta would have won that, he would have jumped up into the number one contender spot, essentially. But what? A, you can't take anything away from Acousta. I mean, Grizzly showed his resilience from getting speared through a barricade and still winning. I really enjoyed this match. Oh, yeah. Uh, oh my god, there we go. Grizzly celebrating his, vi his victory, hard-fought victory here. Uh... Okay, we're having another contest here, of course. And I mean, I mean, this is just impressive right now. Wake the Dead, the t-shirt of Dallas Shaw. He is one of the ESW Tag Team Champions right now. I mean, this man, he looks like a psychopath right now with all of his, oh, yeah. with his attire right I now. I totally agree. You know, I mean, I don't know these guys, but... With that attire right now, like, look, it looks like he has a joker on his pants. I mean, that's a lunatic thing right there. I yeah. mean, like, I don't know what's going on. He wants to wake up the dead. Looks like someone's there with him. AJ. You know, it's, uh, it's, I don't know what's going on. He's, of course, one half of the tag team champions. I'm presuming that's AJ Adams, correct? Correct. Uh, I mean, like, this is, I'm, I'm interested to see what's going to happen. I'm interested to see how this match will go. You know. Me as well. So, but of course, like we said, we really enjoyed the beginning of that match. I don't, we, we both really don't know much. I mean, the owner of ESW called us up, wanted us as commentators, heard me in, in one of the other companies, wanted me, uh, and oh, here we go. Look at this, he's a huge guy, Savage. Savage. 
Oh man, this is a big guy. Yeah, he's a savage, all right. Just by looks alone. Look yeah. at he's just walking straight to the ring. He doesn't he, he does not care about any of the charismatic right now. He just wants a fight. Look at this. He's walking up those steps with intent right now. Like this is gonna be a fight. You can tell. He just wants a piece of that action and I feel he's gonna get it here. Yeah, oh nice little pyro there taunting it looks like AJ Adams right now saying those like I'm gonna win. That's essentially what he's saying. This is it. I'm going to win. Here we go. The ref begins. Here we go. Oh. Is it right from the taunting? Is he taunting? really taunted? Oh, right well, away? <laughs> okay. Well, I guess. Yeah, I that, guess that taunt yeah, came in handy. Yeah, yeah, clearly so. I mean, uh oh. Here we go. Front headlock. Just laying it in there. You know, doing a little bit of damage. Oh, a nice knee to the face. Kick to the shit. What's AJ Adams? He's already jumping up to the ropes. What the hell? I don't know. Anyways, he goes under. He goes under again. What's? Oh, a nice super kick right off the beginning, taunting at Savage. I mean, is that a smart idea to taunt at someone named Savage? Wait, what's going on? What the hell? The, is that even legal? No. What the hell? Yeah, you ref, do your damn job. Come on, that was extreme. That was messed up. This is a two-on-one handicap essentially at this rate. You know, I mean, of course they're tag team partners, so of course they're going to help each other out, but Jesus, you know, are, you, are they that scared of Savage right now that they have to, oh! Ooh, right oh. over the steel steps. Uh, what? What the hell? He picked, oh yeah, damn, Savage throwing AJ Adams into the rubber. Oh, oh my god! Oh my god. What a lariat. I mean, that was, damn, that was like a... I don't know what that was. I mean, that's why you don't take off your eyes on Shaw. That it's that simple. That you don't want to. Wait. Uh oh. Oh, Savage jumps up. He's tired of this. Uh oh, he's going for a clothesline. Another clothesline. Oh, ducks under. Nice power slam. Good slam. I mean, oh my God. I. Uh, uh oh. AJ Adams. Oh, kicks him right in the gut. Oh my God. Uh oh. Uh oh, he taunted. What is this? Oh no, he's going for a tombstone. And then, oh my god, you shouldn't have taken your eyes off of Shaw. So, oh my god, is it's over. It has to be over. A tombstone pile driver down on the mat. It's over. One, two, three. It's over. I, I don't. That was ridiculous. That was pathetic of AJ Adams and Shaw to have to tag team up on this match. To beat Savage. That was messed up. Yes, I totally agree. And Savage was most likely looking for a fair, clean fight. Down to the grit. Yeah, and he didn't get it. He didn't get it. It's because, I guess, they're so intimidated by Savage that they had to call in for help. They can't beat no one fair and square. I see how it is. Hell, I'd be the same way. The sun is rising. Let this be the hour. When we draw swords together. And shall sound in the deep. One last time. Fell deeds awake. Now for wrath. Yes. Now for ruin. Yes. And the red dawn. Yes. <laughs> Wow, thanks for ruining my title match, Mr. Gay. The next time I see your face, I'm gonna kick your ass, so this time, you won't be able to come back to ESW ever again. Here we are, guys. Lance Fierce coming down to the ring right now. I mean, this man... Have you noticed, a lot of the entrances so far are somewhat similar, I don't know, that's kind of confusing, but nice little pyro there, energetic, you can already tell, this is going to be a great match, you know. Yes, I firmly agree with you, partner. But anyways, let, let's talk about Lance Fierce. Lance Fierce alone right now, he, lo he doesn't look like a strong guy, he looks like more of a, more of a high flyer, maybe technical speedy guy. guy. Yeah, yeah, speedy guy, you know. So I'm interested to see if we are correct or if we are wrong. Once again, guys, like I said, we really don't know much of these guys right now. So I'm very, very interested to see what's going to happen here tonight. Ah, uh, here we go. 
Let the match begin. Uh oh, looks like they tried oh. having a power elbow tie. Oh, and a nice knee to the face. Oh, oh nice running drop. No, knees to the face again. Not drop kick. I apologize on that one. Uh oh, just tossing him in the corner. Uh, just tra just punching him in the face continuously. No remorse here. Uh oh, just a strong Irish whip. I know. Uh, what the hell was that? What was that? That was. That's. I don't that know. Is, I don't know what that was. I mean, he's a, a, a medium-sized guy. You wouldn't expect someone like him to be doing that stuff. So I'm, I'm pretty oh. impressed so far. Oh yeah. Uh oh. Here we go. We're getting to a little bit technical here. Now, oh, Ooh. it was a, S, a modified STO here. Going for the pin already. Not even. Was that one guy? It was a one count. Nice even one count. Kicks out. Punches him in the face. But Lance Fierce just does not want to hear it. Oh, and oh, nice, nice. arm drag. Uh, here we go. Kick to the gut. Punch to the face. Could this be the start of Lance? Uh oh. Oh, here we go. Another arm drag. I think that was a Japanese arm drag. You can't quote me on that one. Ah, uh, spin kick. Couple punches. Uh, going Ooh. back. Reversal. Oh, sav uh, bleh, not savage. Uh, he's reversing. Uh oh. Kick to the gut. Big boot to the face. So strong that he went backwards. Uh, went for a kick to the gut. Oh! oh. Oh man, no, this might be a little bit more physical than I thought it would. Strong Irish whip to the ropes, ducks under. Uh oh, what's going on? Up. Oh, oh, winds of change. Oh, going for the pin. One. Oh, just a oh, one. Man. Oh, nice that roundhouse kick to the face. Uh oh. As we kind of see, a lot of these people are hitting each other in the face tonight. I think I think that's pretty much the oh was it wait oh my god I I don't know I didn't think that was illegal but damn uh yeah. uh oh was he going oh go? back my. body drop oh a powerful one someone in the side says hi mom that's that's very interesting hello to that person's mother oh uh, he's gone for the <laughs> end he's gone for the uh oh was he going for Oh my god! If I remember correctly, don't quote me on that. I believe that was the. Oh, wait, what the hell? Mr. K! What is he doing coming down to the ring at this time? Is he. What? What's going on? We were having this. Oh, oh! Oh! He's chasing Mr. K! Mr. K running back! Lance Fierce is like, what the hell? What's going on? We had a match here! Oh, and then backstage! Mr. K just. Oh my god! Assaulting him! Uh oh! Reversal! Uh oh, no. uh oh, right against the doors! Uh, oh my god! Slamming the doors in his face! Just Ow. tossing him on the concrete floor! This is what Mr. K deserves after ruining that match. Uh oh, speaking of Mr. K, he reverses! Oh man! Uh -oh. oh man, what should be going on? Oh, oh tossing him on the glass right now! Uh oh! Oh! Spear onto that brick wall! Oh, nice running drop kick right now! Mr. K running again? What the hell? What? Lance Fierce is still in the ring! What's going on right now? It's, yeah, damn right. Lance Fierce won by count. Uh oh. Uh oh. Something going on. Oh man, he's hurt. He's hurt. I don't know. Lance Fierce won by count out though. So, I mean, oh my. What happened? Mr. K just came in, ruined the match. Lance Fierce was on the ground. I believe he was going to lose. Scoring the victory on the boss of the business never felt so damn good. ALM knows that the, only, the one and only James Icon is a man of his word when he says that he will be victorious at all or nothing. Back in our old days when we used to fight in that ring, he knew that I wasn't an easy opponent. The only surprise was who actually was his opponent at all or nothing. And it was me, James Icon. Now we will take effect in ESW after a match tonight. Here we are at Twisted Society. I mean, clearly these guys are twisted. You could... It's pretty self-explanatory. I mean, look at this yes. entrance. Just coming up. Oh, I, out of the floor. Out of the floor right now. I mean, I don't know what's going to... What, walking through the flames, clearly. You know, I mean, I don't know what's going on here. I mean, Me they're walking down with a purpose. I don't know what that purpose is. But they're doing it. Look at that. Twisted society. I, I mean, what's that? What's that the leader's holding right there? Do you know? Uh, 
Uh, I didn't uh, quite catch a glance. Uh, uh oh, but what's going on? Oh uh, my God! They're talking. Are they having a stare down? Oh no, they're clearly talking. Ta they're, they're talking. They're moving. Uh oh, going for the push. Oh, nice German suplex. Oh, uh oh, throwing him uh -oh. against the ropes. Oh, nice oh, face buster right there. Oh, turning him around. What the hell's going on? Uh, not, oh! Ow. Oh my god. Uh oh. Uh, what's going on here? Jumping up. Oh, what's. 450. Uh, 450 splash going for the pin. One? Two? Three? Was, was that a match? That was a match? What the hell? I'm what, not even sure what the hell that was. What just happened? Like, I. I did, is this a three on one handicap match? What? Well, to instance, society's the victors, but I mean. Damn right they are! It's a three-on-one handicap match! Yeah, of course they're gonna be winning! I'm not even sure how that was even remotely fair! I don't even think that was a minute! Uh, what's going on here? Uh-oh, chance... All the fans are screaming, you're crazy! Damn right they're crazy, it's Twisted Society! wrestling. You might not know me, but you should. I am the man who has ended careers. I am the man who was 45 no, and I quit matches. My name is Frost Demon. You see, ESW, I don't care who I have to go down there and kick ass to. I don't care if I have to go and kick Troy White's ass, James Icons, Jesse Smokes, Troy Gibson, or hell, even ALM. Because you know something when I get down that ring. When I see them on the ground, them, their fans, their family, everyone begging for me to stop beating them when their blood-covered bodies is looking up at me, begging for me to stop. No, I'm not. ESW, you're ready. Your nightmare is near. I am the eternal nightmare. I am your worst nightmare. I am the hell's gatekeeper. Because when I open up those gates, I have to drag a victim in there, and I don't care who. I don't care who's the biggest guy or the smallest guy. I'll go to the top of the damn ladder and take his ass out if I have to. Don't think I won't. So ESW, get ready. Your worst nightmare is here. Well, here we are, folks. I mean, what an impressive night so far. We are far from over, clearly. Oh, yeah. I mean, what's your opinion of this so far? I, know, I, I mean, Extreme Slam Wrestling, I'm loving this so far. We have seen some amazing matches tonight. Yep. I cannot believe all the things I have seen some of these men endure. I know, and here, as we speak, we're, we're looking at the future here. Ryan Riley, I believe I got that right. I mean, look at this man. I don't think I don't really see a place that has tattoos to touch yet, except for his face, of course. 
but <laughs> damn. <laughs> he is he is the self-proclaimed future, so I'm interested to see how this goes. Ryan Riley in a match tonight. I don't know I really don't know this guy. I really don't. Neither do you, Joe. But I'm I'm very intrigued to see what happens. You know, I mean to be able to proclaim that you're the future, you have to back it up, of course. So you have to prove yourself in that ring. Well, so I'm I'm interested to see it. So and he has to prove it to not only myself, not only to yourself, but to the fans. That is the most important factor of this company. Of, of everything of wrestling is you have to pro pro bleh, prove it to the fans. Now here he, he now here comes his opponent. Holy sh crap! I mean, he, damn, he's intimidating. Oh, I yeah. mean, <laughs> I agree. I, mean, I hate to be back in the ring with that man. Yeah, I mean, Ryan. Looks of him. Yeah, Ryan Riley has a little bit of a challenge here, clearly. So I'm interested to see how this goes. I mean, look at look at that. You know, Chris Blade. Chris Blade. I mean, <laughs> I mean, some of his his finishing moves are known as the throwing knife, and I can't remember the other one right now. That's bad on my part. <laughs> but I mean damn <laughs> both these guys are very intimidating but right now Blade kind of has the more intimidation factor right now yes, so I firmly agree with you I, I, I'm interested to see how this goes you know I mean I'm expecting big things on this match you know we're, we're, we're looking at a dude who's intimidating versus the dude who's self-proclaimed future so this has to go fairly well hopefully so just walking around the ring it's very, very uh oh oh uh -oh. nice triple threat match here going on this is the main event here Chris Blade, Ryan Riley versus the ESW champion. I believe we've seen him earlier. I mean, this is going to be one of the best main events I will ever cover. Probably my Tom, my bleh, yes commentating career here. Tony Gibson, just look at that. He's getting pumped up here. So I mean, this is. I, he's already, I, I wouldn't do that. Essentially, you know. I mean, you know, you might want to. You might get tired a little bit. You know, so, I mean, that's all up to him. I mean, like, damn, look at that face paint. Wow, live or die, as he says. Uh, and also, this is his second match of the night. Well, this is the second match. Remember, he, he requested mic time. So, yes. and so I mean, I mean, look at this. He is pumped up. He is ready for a fight. And this is going to be... A fight, ladies and gentlemen. We got here Ryan Riley, the future, versus Chris Blade, versus Tony Gibson. Oh, here we go. Already. To oh, nice little tag team action we got over here. You know, two on one. Uh oh, Chris Blade's not having none of that. Reversing that. Oh, go you have to remember. Ooh. You have to remember, this is also a triple threat match. Oh, yeah. So, I mean, uh, you know. Alliances are gonna last long. Here we go. Nice little combo here. You know, I mean, damn. Oh, let's see this. Throwing him in the corner. Ryan going for a drop kick. Man, don't, they, they clearly they're all afraid of Chris Blade. Getting rid of the big man here. Uh oh. Oh, nice little hip toss here. Going for the pin already. One. Not even a one. Well, I mean, it was a one count, but dang, that was a Nothing slow. More. Oh. And, they won't let Chris Blade with any momentum. The second he starts gaining a little bit, they ruin it. That's smart. Chris Blade clearly is the bigger man. He is clearly one of the uh, one of the most intimidating men in ESW, and so you got to get rid of him first. Of course, that's very smart. Oh, nice jump over. And a nice another arm drag. I mean, uh, what the hell? Oh my God! Is he doing the? Oh my God! <laughs> Okay, going for a nice little um, live or die elbow, as I'm going to be calling it now. You know, I know. But, uh, no, oh, referee. Oh Come on, going oh for the that. pin. One. 
Not oh my god, Chris Blade, you gotta be you gotta be impressed with his resiliency so far. What's this? Ryan Ryan jumping out of the ring. What the hell? Uh oh, Chris Blade reversed. Oh, went for a diving cross body. Oh, it needed a face. Uh-oh. Uh-oh. Nick sent it for a curb stop. Oh, my God. As oh we see, all or nothing, he hit that with his opponent at all or nothing pay-per-view. Uh-oh. He's going, is he going for a little comeback here? Ryan Riley's right behind him, though. What the? Oh! He just rejects that. He just, the second Chris Play turns around, Ryan goes for a clothesline. Uh-oh. Oh, a nice little spin kick. Uh-oh. Is he going for Nice little triple jumping elbows. Trip there. Tripping. Triple, triple elbow drops. Elbow. There we go. I am drinking too much beer here. <laughs> uh, nice yeah. little combination. Oh, he's going for another comeback. Did, did I see Tony Gibson leaving the ring? I think I did. I believe so. Uh oh. Oh, nice diving cross body. Yep, Tony Gibson left the ring. Uh oh, Chris Blade's gaining some momentum here. Oh, he's turned around. Oh, Ooh. nice roundhouse kick to the face. Going for the pin. Uh oh, here we go. One, two. Oh, oh Tony oh. Gibson stops at the last second. Uh oh, I think Alliance is starting to. No. Nope. No, nope. here we go. Nice double team move. Again, nice double drop kick. Uh oh, oh wait, they're not over here. Oh! oh Wow, that that's that's a tag team move there. Uh oh. And uh, what the hell was that? I don't know what that was, but uh, oh, a Swanton bomb! Oh, going for the pin. One, two, and uh, no kick out. You gotta give Chris Blade that. I don't know. Oh, what the hell? What was that? Uh, uh oh. Oh, is he? How did he get busted off? And going for the pin. One, two, th no. Ooh, Ryan trying going for the pin, trying to gain the advantage. But uh oh, that means alliances are over. Here we go, Ryan going jumping in there. Uh oh, signaling for the end. Oh, and a super kick to the face. Uh oh, is this over? Nope, nope. Tony Gibson got up. Oh, nice twist the wheel arm drag on Ryan. Ryan Riley, uh oh, just slamming his body in the corner. A uh, nice throat thrust from Tony Gibson to Ryan Riley. Uh, picking up Chris Blade. What's going on here? Oh, he kicked up. Ryan Riley kicked up. Oh, I don't think Tony Gibson noticed. Uh oh. Oh, uh -oh. putting both of them. Oh, what a drop kick to the back. Oh, he's doing it continuously. Uh oh, picking up Tony Gibson. What is he going for? Throwing him to the corner. Uh oh. Oh, Tony gets a reverse. Oh, nice backflip off that. Uh oh. Re oh, goes for the elbow. Misses. Oh, and two. Oh. I hit arm drag. Sorry, guys. I mean, that was it. Ryan was going for some freaking huge momentum here. Uh oh. Tony Gibson picks up Chris Blade. Chris Blade reverses. What's going on here? Oh, Lutez press. From Ryan Riley to Chris Blade. Uh-oh, what's going on here? What? Oh, punch to the gut. Another one. Tony Gibson falls to the ground. You you heard that thud from here. I oh, mean, yeah. Uh-oh. Do Ryan Riley throw. Oh! Ooh, on to the steel step. I think his head hit that. I think, oh! Double knees to the face. Hey, guys, get, get away from the announcer table. Come on. Like, I don't... We don't want them that... You guys to break that. This is like our. Oh, never mind. Oh God, slamming his head on the announce table. I. Uh, uh oh, what the hell? What the hell? Gut wrench, power bomb. That was strong. Oh, th Tony Gibson throwing Ryan to the ring. Nice elbow to the face, going for a leg drop. Oh man. Oh, uh oh. Tony Gibson signaling for the end here. Turns him over. Oh no. And a F5. Oh my god. Tony Gibson. It's over. Tony. Get, it's over. Chris Blake gets up. Oh. He, I think he was going for the pin. But Ryan reversed. Uh, what's going on? Uh -oh. Little. Just stare down. But uh oh. Chris Blade's up. And oh. Nice Sambo suplex. Oh. Super kick to the face. It's, is it over? What the? Go for the pin. What are you doing? Go for the pin. Don't taunt! You're stupid! You could have went for the pin and won! 
Of course, Tony Gibson does an arm drag. Uh, took the world arm drag. Ryan gets up right away. Little stare down going on. Chris Blade gets up. I will punch the gut continuously. Uh oh. What the hell? Oh, he throws him to the second rope. What's going on? Ooh. Uh oh. And that, oh, nice knee to the face there. Oh, and die, a jumping moonsault. A standing moonsault there. Going for the pin. Not even a one count. Ryan reverses. Oh, he throws uh, Chris Blade out of the ring. Well, not really. He throws him on the ropes. Oh, and Tony Gibson just kicks him down. Uh oh. Oh, no. A back body drop there. Oh, my, oh God. my God. What a match here. Uh oh. What is he going for? Is he going for a nice, another triple diamond uh, elbow drops there? I keep on mistaking that. Oh, look at that. Chris Blade had a bat on there. Uh oh. I don't know what's going on. Oh, swept the legs there. What's going to happen here? What's going to happen here? Throws him on the run up. Oh, throws him out. Oh, punches him out of the ring again. I think Tony Gibson wants wants Ryan. Uh oh, Ryan turns him around. Throws him to the ropes. What's going to happen? What's going on here? What? Oh. Oh. I don't know. the distraction. Uh, oh! A kick to the face! A di oh my god! A diving swanton bomb off the ropes! Everybody's down except for Chris Blade. He got right up! Uh, what is he going for? Why do we have so many weapons down here? I got champ! Oh! He's going to diving cross body! Hits him directly! I think the chair was even connected. That could fracture some ribs easily. Uh oh. Oh, yeah. uh oh. F5 on the concrete. We both know there's like barely no padding there. Uh oh. Oh, Chris Blake got up, throws him to the ropes. What's going to happen here? Nice elbow to the face there. Ryan is just knocked out, I think. He, he is not. Oh, no, never mind. Scratched out. He got up. Oh, a face buster. Runs to the ring. What's going to happen here? They're having a stare down. Ryan. Uh oh, they're taunting. Oh, okay, a punch to the face, of course. That's why, why does everybody taunt in front of everybody? Oh, man. Uh oh, bouncing off the ropes. Oh, a nice diving. Oh, wait, what the hell? Close line. What the hell? What? A trash can. Okay, um, don't know what to say about that. But, okay, oh, they bumping into each other continuously. Uh, a spine bust. Oh, almost. I think his shoulder hit the edge of the, the, the trash can. Oh, oh my God. Cool. Why is he taunting? And uh, of course, the super kick in the face. Is this over? No. Wait, what? Dude, you should have went for the pin. What's he doing? Uh oh, turns him over. And a super kick to him. Oh my god. Uh, he's go uh, wait, what? What? Is he. Is he leaving the ring? He's leaving the match. Ryan just super kicked both Tony Gibson and Chris Blade and leaving the match. Why? He's the self proclaimed future. They're both knocked out. What's going to happen? Uh-oh. Uh-oh. Tony Gibson was up before Chris Blade. What's going to happen? Oh, oh. Chris Blade going for a comeback here. Uh-oh. Throwing him to the corner. Uh, no. Oh, no. Nice cross body there. Uh-oh. It's over. It has to be. Oh, no, no, no. Oh. Tony, Tony Gibson's getting up. Oh, God. Oh, uh, see, Chris Play reversed. Oh, no, another another backflip off there. Going for a clothesline. Misses in a diving clothesline. Uh-oh. Both hit their comeback. What's going to happen? Tony Gibson taunting to the crowd. I believe that was to Ryan. Of course you don't do that. Uh-oh. Is he going for the... Oh! It's oh, over. Wow, One, two, three. Oh, Chris Play oh, won. Oh, man. That was hellacious. Yeah, he earned that victory. Ryan, for some reason, left the match. He had the victory, but he left the match. No idea why, but thank you guys. This has been Thane and Joe. See y'all later. Hope you enjoyed the episode.